Welcome to Pro Upcast News, where we bring you daily industry updates. Today is Monday, August 17th, and you're watching the Afternoon Update with Sarah Fletcher. Today's news is sponsored by Covenant Reliance Producers. We build success stories. For more information, please visit www.crproducers.com. Now for today's headlines. The Federal Reserve today announced plans to extend the term Asset-Backed Securities Loan Facility, or TALF, an emergency program intended to increase lending in the commercial real estate market. The Federal Reserve and the Department of Treasury said they will extend the program to June 30th for newly issued commercial mortgage-backed securities. Meanwhile, the regulators also extended TALF through March 31st for newly issued asset-backed securities and already issued or legacy commercial mortgage-backed securities. In investment news, the price per barrel for oil this morning dipped below $66 on the New York Mercantile Exchange. This news surprisingly comes amid reports that the first hurricane of 2009 is expected to increase in size before striking the U.S. coast. Findings indicate that the benchmark cost of crude for September delivery this morning dropped 3% or more than $2 to $65.45 a barrel. This means prices have dropped nearly 7% in two days. In related news, the first tropical storm of the year, Hurricane Bill, picked up steam this morning as it spun towards Bermuda. In fact, the U.S. National Hurricane Center reports that the storm's top winds reached 90 miles per hour, just below a Category 2 hurricane. And the hurricane is expected to grow to a more significant Category 3 storm with winds of more than 110 miles an hour by late Wednesday morning at the latest. I'm Sarah Fletcher and thanks for watching ProUpcast News. For more in-depth news and features, visit producersweb.com.